So to SPF or not to SPF through the winter? That is the question. And if you're wondering whether you should be wearing an SPF product all winter, even here in Britain where it's cold and there's very little sun, the answer is yes. And the simple reason is, is that UV rays are one of the biggest factors in premature aging of the skin. And um, we have UVB rays, we have UVA rays. The B rays are the ones that tan us and most SPF products offer protection against that. But what you want is a product that also, and not all of them do, offer protection against UVA because those are actually the ones that are going to do the damage. Also, if you use uh, products like retinol, you absolutely need to protect your skin and uh, you, you must wear SPF all year round. So anyone on here will know that I'm a great lover of um, Evi technology. They do really wonderful SPF products with very high UVA protection. And the thing I love about it is it's, it's a very light mousse and it will go over any products that you use uh, normally during the day. And it's very easy to put makeup on over it. So it, it really is great. Um, it's incredibly easy to use and I'm going to show you right now. You just need a very small little squirt. Um, and then you rub it between your hands until it forms into a little cream. And then you just put some into your skin. And as you will see, it just absolutely disappears very quickly. Put a bit more on my nose. There we go. Uh, if I have any extra, I put it on my hands because I think it's good to protect our hands as well. And um, normally, I, in the summer, I will wear their, their SPF 50, but uh, for the winter, I stick to this one, which is the SPF 30, which I think is absolutely fine for the winter. And um, uh, it's also got uh, hyaluronic acid in it. It's got collagen in it. So you don't need any, you don't actually need to wear anything at all. I mean, if I'm in a bit of a hurry, I'll just put this one on. If if I've got time, I might put uh, one of my serums on, but I certainly wouldn't put a moisturizer on afterwards. And then just put on your foundation if you're going to be wearing it and uh, wait about five minutes. And so I really can't recommend this one enough. And this is what I will be wearing uh, for the winter. This and of course, Chanel number no. five. Uh, if you'd like to check it out, it's in the Ageless shop and uh, you can read uh, more about it there.